Oh, night. What's up? X not here yet. Um. Is Lane? Is that you? Don't tell me he's in his head right now. I guess X isn't here. Okay. Who? Mr. Mr. Lang? I guess he's in his head or something. I'm probably waiting for X to get here. All right. Till, thanks for the sub. You know, oh, I adore you and love you with all my heart, but I am begging that you take that chain off before you talk to X. Oh, oh, I forgot I had it on. Sorry. That's okay. Um. How you been? Nope. I was, uh, so what, uh, you get the supplies for the casino? Yeah, I'm working on getting them right now. Uh, okay. you on X okay? I, I don't know. I called him to give him the Polito money. He said he's busy and, uh, give it to him later. Give him the what? Uh, we did a Polito a few days ago. I still owe him the cut. Are you aware of the war and how he thinks you gave him some information that, uh, might have caused the war? Are you aware of it? any of that? Gave the information that caused the war. What yeah, information? Anybody spoken to you about this? Wait, what information? Uh, Something about Rami getting ocean dumped? Rami got ocean dumped. Well, I know he got ocean dumped, but we don't know by who. Um, I asked X and Marty. They said it wasn't them. So. So, X seems to believe that it was you that gave the information. Well, I can't really give information I don't have, can I? I agree. I mean, I didn't. I'm not saying that I believed it. I, I am shocked that uh, uh -huh. he hasn't even spoken to you to see if this was true. Ah, well, I'm a little less shocked by that. It is X, you know. And from what it sounds like, his squad's been getting gunned down for days, and they don't even know why. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I, I will say something. I mean, X is uh, a little bit hurt. He just really yeah. wants. Uh, not that there to be problems between you guys. I mean, he's going to tell you himself, but uh, okay. I think it's good that you just tell him how you sincerely feel yeah, about the course. whole thing. Um, yeah. I mean, if I'm honest, though, no matter what happens here, it's not going to change the situation he's in, right? I've already ended the war. Oh, really? Oh, we're good then. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But now, I just want to make sure that you guys are good and there's no... Uh, um, There's no uh, tension or any sort of. I just want you guys to be on the same page. You know, have a conversation. Yeah, I, yeah I, of I course. I mean, all this shit and as you guys far have as I know, that. there's no crazy. I mean, I was just gonna give him the money from Polito. We did like, literally a day or two ago. Um, and uh, you know, you know, I love you with all my heart, and I just want you to see you succeed, and I just want you to be happy. And uh, I think uh, uh -huh. it is important that uh, sometimes, you know, when your friends have a problem, it's good to talk to them. Uh, oh yeah, I, I mean that's friends, the best way to do it. it, it yeah, you don't want to let them down. I feel like a lot of problems could be solved if people just talk to each other more instead of, you know, jumping a shooting or killing or ocean dumping Rami, like you said, right? It's better to just talk about it, you know? Yeah, but it's also important to uh, yeah. embrace and understand the mistakes that our friends make because in their mind, yeah. they, in their perspective, they are right in what they do, right? Listen, everybody makes mistakes. It's normal, exactly. you know? You know, something I uh, once said was, who do you trust more, the person who you've never seen mess up or the person you see that tries to fix it when they do? You know? Uh, definitely the second option. Exactly. If you know someone's never trying to hurt you and they're your friend and, yeah, friends make mistakes, but they're still going to try and make it work out, I feel like that means more than, you know. You sure I should take the chain off? Yes, 100%. Yes. But the war is over, No troll, no troll. Oh, Marty, what's up? All right. I didn't know you were at the meeting. Hi. Hey, you're wearing the burger oh. shot outfit. <laughs> yeah. This is going to be great. We finally can make some money. Cool. Yep. Uh, I spoke to you know a little right. bit. Uh, are you guys aware that uh, he mm -hmm. never told him anything or even knew that you guys ocean dumped Rami? Yeah, I called okay. Marty. He said, he said it never happened. So, I mean, it's not you guys, right? It sounded like they just got the wrong guys, and I told Marty, like, they're convinced it's you guys, but, I mean. 
No. <clears throat> okay. Um. Was, let's what's try with the glasses? Okay. If it wasn't you, um, let's turn the it must have been please. some really good microscopic fly or something. Microscopic fly? What do you mean? What I'm saying is that, um, I think, and Mike can agree, we took the proper precaution uh, before we did what we did because we didn't want to get you guys in hot water and yeah. Steven in hot water because over the years, uh, I think we understand that we shouldn't uh, get Steven a full-fledged war that nobody wants because yeah. overall, Steven doesn't like war, and I agree with that, uh -huh. right? And I thought, and I tell you if I'm wrong, Marty, I thought <clears throat> that me and Marty would get our own vendetta, our own um, piece of, I don't know, how would you call it? Revenge, mm. vengeance, justice. Yeah, for ourselves, yeah. right? And we'd do it in a clean way, and then we could just kind of move on from it, right? Mm -hmm. For a little bit of peace of mind, if you will. But it seems like um, instead we kind of got nothing out of it, and things just kind of escalated. Mm. We were hiding in a spot for like 30 minutes, got Rami, ocean dumped him, and I don't think their helicopter ever saw our main car, because they chased okay. uh, Jack in a uh, rented Fudo instead. And if they knew right. that we were in our car, I mean, let's be honest, they would have just chased us instead, right? Yeah, that would make a lot more sense. But how did they know it was you then? Uh, I don't know. But regardless, they, they said that you told uh, your sister, uh, whoever that is, and that you told uh, all of them uh, everything pretty much. You, the, right. He said that you told them um, that we picked them up, we robbed them, we shot them, and we ocean dumped them. The whole thing. Uh, no, I didn't even know you guys did that. Listen, here's what happened. You know, my, uh, my sister's in CG, right? They're doing the vault. Okay. So I told her I, I'm on a rooftop with a sniper ready to shoot you just to try and mess with her because, you know, it's kind of funny. Um, that was it. And then I, it's kind of awkward. I dressed up as a girl for like 30 minutes to try and hide by the vault. And then, uh, that that was the whole day for me and then okay they told me a bunch <clears throat> of stuff happened and asked me if i knew anything about it and i said no and then after that i called marty and said hey That's did you guys up. do anything marty said no so i That's okay you know, um, um yeah i don't want to get caught up on like specifics and small things yeah. i think yeah. our own beliefs here and what actually happened is very blurry and i think combining like combining the whole mm -hmm. thing is kind of a mess i don't need to do that i think we could draw a bigger picture um, which is a little bit, um, it's a little bit of a heavy, a heavy hitting picture compared yeah. to this, this small scale one thing. Wait, you're telling I me think... they told you that, you know, told them all that stuff. Yeah. But I think regardless but... though, this is a very like small incident that yeah. doesn't really show like, um, it doesn't really hurt us immediately. Right. Mm -hmm. It's more of a, this little of a pattern. It's like the symbolism of what happened. And I think it's, it's the frequency of it. Uh, that's been uh, a problem overall, and I think uh, maybe I'm wrong about this, but the main problem that me and Marty had with CG is that me and Marty were up uh, in the other county, and we were doing research like day in day out. The other county. You know? okay. And when we got here, right. um, we didn't know how to hit the lower lower vault, and it was a project of ours to figure it out, and it was really it's hard true. because we spent a lot of money on it and we couldn't do shit. It was. And the one time when we actually figured it out. And we're really proud. Mm -hmm. um, progress, not money. Progress. Uh, we got robbed, and that's what robbed me the wrong way. I was there for it. Is that we got robbed of progress, which um, which kind of hurt a uh, uh, cut steeper, right? And yeah, we've been trying. Me, only me and Marty, in the ways that are more targeted and more um, tactical, of getting at least one hit of vengeance. So it's just one good hit. And it seems like every time we just don't get there, right? Hmm. And that is true. What I'm trying to get at is that um, a lot of times I can't help but feel like it's your fault. What do you, well, look, I want to be honest. A lot of times it is my fault, but this time it can't be. I didn't even know you guys ocean dumped them. I don't know how they could tell you that I told them that. That's what's most confusing for me because we literally, you know, we lied straight to your face because we didn't want CB involved and apparently 
something about you said something. So I, I, that's why I'm so confused on all of this. I don't know what really happened. I mean, I don't know either. Okay. I'm, well, I, I think. L listen, they called me asking know, about it, and the first yeah, thing they said to me was, "It's you guys." And I said, "I time, didn't even know that." Let's just let's just forget about it. Let's forget about it. Here's the point. Here's the point. Here's what I think, and I'm trying to tell you. In times of war, right, people can claim that they're neutral, and they can say that they're neutral and they're everybody's friend. But the truth is that in times of war, everybody picks a side, right? Whether it's one or the other, everybody picks one. And it feels to me like every time you pick CG over us, and it hurts us. Yeah, I mean... It hurts me, Marty. And these wounds, they cut deep. You understand? And mm -hmm. I think the big problem uh, combined with that is that um, you want to do good, right? You want to be the one to uh, help somebody in need. And we're, we're your friend. And they are your friends, right? But every time that we're about to try to do a hit on them, and hurt them, I understand that you want to save them. And that's what you choose. Yeah. You try to save them. And that's the intent. But the reality of it is, the result is that you're killing us. Not wrong. You understand? You're saving them, but you're but killing us. It's, it's hard, I mean. That's how it is with war, man. You, 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 you make a decision, you pick a side. You can't be neutral. It's just not a thing. But why, why do I have to see, I mean, Look, they're not perfect, and neither are you. But you're all my friends, and I don't like seeing anybody get hurt. Well, not you or them. In the end, only me and Marty and the squad get hurt. That's yeah, true. I mean, that the, is, the, the reality I mean, is, uh, is the X and his boys that the, they they got absolutely, uh, you know, with all the respect, seeming, seemingly they got destroyed, like you guys got I bet. slaughtered. But at the end of the day, uh, you know, I do believe that you can be neutral, just as I was, in the, for example, in the grand scheme of this uh, recent shitstorm i just didn't get involved all right i didn't help x i didn't help marty they know how i feel about the war but at the same time i'm not giving any information to uh k or rami not even you know unintentional trolling nothing if they ask me i just tell them straight up i'm just not involved don't come yeah. to me with this you know I, mean, I mean i told them i wasn't there i didn't see anything that happened and yeah this time it's fine like mm -hmm. i said i think it's been a conversation we would want had i have because um i i understand that you want to do good right but if in times of, of um neutrality if you were more neutral like it just feels to me or to us me and marty at least that whenever you flip the coin of 50 50 you always get the 49 and cg gets the 51 and that's I mean... usually the decisive factor and whether we get absolutely fucked for multiple days if not weeks and look like a bunch of jackasses and yeah, I mean, that's look, the turning point look you know i don't want to make you look like that i have more respect for you than almost anybody in the city the only other that's person i true. have the same amount of respect for is right here sorry marty and me i no. mean and marty um, yeah <laughs> yeah Mar hey, marty it's okay Mar marty it's okay it's okay <laughs> okay yeah, it's guys like, like i said i think it is important that we stay united uh, everyone's gonna make mistakes yeah. everyone's gonna do some crazy shit. uh but it is important to embrace the mistakes that we do make and look for the most positive outcome possible in my opinion fair enough yeah. and i think if this, this is the price of this alliance and friendship that i'm i'm willing to i'm willing to pay it. uh and i wouldn't trade for anything else you know yeah and and i wouldn't trade for anything else as well it's, it's nothing we will still do cool shit and hit the mm -hmm. big the big licks Right. Nobody more fun to hang out with, that's for sure. Now we are even starting a business is. empire. We have too much good going on for us to be focusing on the little petty shit that may sometimes spiral out of control, but ultimately can be resolved. I completely agree with that. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Then maybe the problem stems from just um, me leading, leading me and Marty into fucking trying to hit them uh, when we can to try to make back for what we uh, have lost. Which I think we can't really get back ever, but yeah. I think if we get the supplies and we we get a we get a we get a good hit today, um, I, I think it's a, it's a first step to um. Uh, you're right. Though. It's not just it. 
Yeah, it's not just you guys. I definitely. It's not. It's not wasn't... just you. Okay, it, it's yeah. all of us. I admire the balls that you have, X, and that Marty has to seek revenge on when somebody does you wrong. But I Especially also CG, feel that's like sometimes crazy. thinking it through as well is very important. But you guys do definitely have the fucking balls. I don't think I'll ever question that. But I do think in the mm -hmm. long run, um, that moment where you fulfill that revenge uh, might have felt good, but weeks after that might have been, you know, absolutely, you know, just not worth doing. Yeah. Speaking so, this for the betterment of yourselves, because you guys got a lot of good shit going on. You're building up GG. Though. We're going to get these fucking gas stations. You guys want to start GG Enterprises. We're, we're doing a partnership. We just fucking beat the casino. God knows what yeah. else, you know, going to be... We're, God knows what else kind of intel we're gonna get a, a shit to rob in the future. We got a sick fucking crew that we beat it with. We got a lot going on than to, uh, you know, get lost and shit like that. Okay. Um, Buddha, I think me and X are literally on the same wavelength as that. But okay. like when we did that that Rami thing, we like when we were doing it along the way, it felt like we were doing everything right to not be attached to it. But yeah. it just so happens that we did somehow get attached to it. Cause like we caught him. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I, I don't himself, think you guys. No radio, nothing. Like you know, like we tried doing it completely right. Yeah, I'm not blaming you guys. No Hell, I mean, if you guys would have gotten away with that, I would have applauded it, quite frankly. But at the end of the day, you know, things will happen that sometimes we don't expect. Like, like I said, and when those things happen, it's important to try to come out, with, think of the best possible outcome instead of kind of going down that deep dark hole of chaos and despair and depression and. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. It was worth it though. I'm gonna give it a buck. I mean, she, it, when we what? when we were had camped that fucking spot, shit's in Rami, man. Did he just say it was worth it? He looked like he looked like a kid with his his mouth full of fucking chocolate, right? In the in the fucking you know, show the light. Like he was like, huh? and then we had him right there with our guns out. He he should have seen it. The way he was talking, it, it was funny. It was worth it. It is what well, it is. I'm glad it was worth it. I'm okay. glad it got your revenge. Now we are going to end this. We're going to stay strong and united. Yeah, there's there's nothing else yeah. we got to talk about here. Everything's good. That's the best way to go, I think. Well, there's one so more thing. I'm going do. to go grab the supplies for the casino. We're going to go hit the casino. I'm going to right. pay for the supplies, and you're going to embrace my flaws and move on, X. All right. You're paying for the supplies? What? Yes. Oh, my fucking God. You're okay. going to embrace that flaw Wait, in me. Mr. X, come with me for one minute. I got to... Right? Got to tell you something. Okay. Right, X? Yeah, I can, get, I can live past it. Good. All right. I'll be back later. Yeah, just one, one second over here. All right. He's not coming. He's not coming. I'm about to shoot him, guys. I'm just kidding. I wonder what him and Marty are talking about. Is he just leaving? He's just leaving. <laughs> Uh, it's better that way, maybe. Oh, wait, no, he is coming. Chat must have told him. Chat must have told him. Hey, Mr. X. What is it? Look. You know, you're not wrong. I always, uh... I if you want to know how it works, it's not a coin flip when I try and tell people things. It's always whoever has the disadvantage, I try to give them the advantage to reduce the chances they get attacked. And I'm, I'm yeah. going to be honest, you're so crazy, you always attack no matter how bad the situation looks. Um, yeah, I just feel like CG is rarely at his advantage, that's all. They just act like true. it, I and mean, uh, they know it. for a fact that you're going to help them out. Here's the um, thing, though. You know, you're probably wondering if uh, I'll always be on your side. Right? Yeah. Well, look at this chain. Got gems in it. You, 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 motherfucker. So no, no. Motherfucker. I'm giving it to you. <laughs> Why, are you gonna wear it? Just like that? Thought you'd hate it. Oh. <laughs> What's he doing? Hey, where are you going? <laughs> what are you doing? Mr. X, where are you going? What? Just running off. I'm throwing the chain, man. You're throwing it. Oh, are you crazy? Oh, listen, listen. I didn't give it to you so you'd throw it away. I thought you were going to use not? it to sneak in and get revenge again. 
get in a different outfit, wear that, walk up to Little Soul one day. Can't be doing that. They might fall for it. Yeah, the pool's all in hot water, man. We better look like a square one. Now listen, it's kind of fun though. You said it was worth of it after all, care, didn't man. you? You can't disagree of after that. Of course you don't care, man. Because <laughs> you're sleeping when we get our fucking booty cheeks clapped raw, man. Hey, you know who was asleep when Kratos was getting dropped out of helicopters, killed 20 times over? Uh, <laughs> but look, it's kind of fun though sometimes, isn't it? I mean, I've been ocean dumped before. It's a little not fun, but you said it was worth it after all, right? Well, you can have it back. Don't wear it. <laughs> Not what I'm listen, around anyway. Listen, listen. You hold on to it. Give it back to me after uh, when it's time, you know? I just want you to know Shame. that you're always going to be my friend, and you're one of the most respected people in the city for me. You too, And friend. even though it might not look that way all the time, more than CG, more than almost anybody. Uh, I mean, look. I love you, my brother. You know the lower vault that they robbed us at? How many people know how to do it? You, Marty, I'm the only person outside of Gulag gang that even knows. You trusted me with that, so it means a lot. I'm right. We'll never be able to do it again, though, now that the electricity's changed, but... Yeah, I'm sorry. I mean, if we forget new stuff, we forget the casino. Yeah. I mean, if you, you should take it. a picture with that, and uh, it looked like you won the war or something. Oh, yeah, that's, um... <clears throat> Maybe you shouldn't. That'd make it worse, huh? Yeah, uh, you're not wrong. I do make it, it worse sometimes. But it's fun, though. <laughs> um, uh, let's go hit that. And, um... All right. You know, let's let's, uh, let's go s celebrate with, uh, with some good monies. Yeah. Uh, some good monies. Let's go that. do the casino. Been waiting after all. Yeah. Yeah, well, if you think about it, when we uh, we put the drill to the to the wall and we started getting those laptops out of there, mm -hmm. it, you know, it was a feeling that I don't think any of them uh, um, had... You know, or are gonna have, it. and it was only us. Uh -huh. You know, yeah, Me, we you got and that squad. panther, and that's the thing you, you just can't buy, Mister. You know, mm -hmm. no chain, money, ink bag, or dirty money is gonna buy that for us. Yeah, you no, know? only friends can. Well, it's not buying it. Damn right. Hey, uh, you got the smoke again. coming out now. It's kind of cool. Yeah, I mean, I got all types of smoke today, man. All the smoke today. All right, I got all of it. Let's go get ready for the casino. Uh, all right. Hey, you want to help me and Marty run the burger shot one day? Oh, uh, no. Ah, poop. Neither do I, but I think Marty can do a better job, and I'm just kind of there to mark it. I mean, he managed it for me back in the days. That's what he told me. All right? Well, we should get going. All right. Well, guys, this is as good as it goes. But I think giving him the chain and telling him to give it back later uh, when, you know, when the time's right is probably the best way it could go. Because um, obviously he's worried about whether he really thinks we're his friend or not and all that. And we were worried about whether he lied to us about the ocean dump or not when, I'm going to be honest, everybody could guess it was him. So, I mean... Uh, uh, it is just a lot of miscommunication, guys, and like Mr. Lang said, we literally never talk to each other, so it's kind of, it's kind of awkward, but.